Hey guys, it's Bryant with I Have Comic Issues, and today I'm going to show you a, a comic book haul that I did uh, back in November. Haven't had a chance to film this yet, but got a comic book haul that I'm going to show you real quick. These ones right here, and then I'm going to also show you an eBay purchase that I picked up uh, just last week uh, that. Uh, is a book that's going to fill a really big run for me on my X-Men. But please take a moment to like uh, this video, comment on it. Uh, please subscribe if you haven't already. Uh, and now, without any further ado, uh, let's get started. Uh, picked up, some, uh, went to one of my local flea markets here, and I picked up some uh, dollar comic books. And... Uh, I uh, picked up a little mini series, Wolverine The End. Got issue number one right here. Really nice copy. Okay, issue number two. Issue number three. Issue number four. Issue number five and issue number six. And in this uh, particular uh, mini series, uh, Wolverine meets, uh, I think it's uh, one of his, he's a lot older and he meets one of his uh, brothers or relatives. And I got all of those for a dollar a piece. And here's two others that I picked up uh, Wolverine books that I picked up that were a dollar a piece also. And this is Wolverine issue number 87. We got two of them right there. Pick these up for a dollar a piece. And I got these uh, at the flea market uh, uh, from Tim's Toys uh, at the TNW flea market. I also got from Tim uh, a couple of uh, one shot uh, kind of graphic novels. Got Wolverine The Reign of Tierra for a dollar. Really cool. And then I also picked up three copies of Wolverine Jungle Adventure. Uh, very nice grade. Uh, these are actually key issues and it features, uh, or it has a Wolverine's, um, I guess the birth of one of Wolverine's children. Uh, not any of the main one like Dakin or uh, X-23, but that's still a pretty cool book. And then from one of my uh, local uh, stores, other, an actual local uh, comic book shop that's not in a flea market, I picked up a couple of uh, books. I really like the original Sin uh, miniseries. So I picked up, I uh, got issue number zero here. I also got issue number one right there. We got issue number four right there. These are all really minty. These were not a dollar. I probably paid about four or so dollars a piece. And then I also got issue number uh, five. And with these, I actually have the whole uh, mini series of Original Sin. Um, and I also have the annual uh, somewhere in my PC. Uh, then I also picked up uh, Venom number 30. I think this is the volume four. This is a uh, uh, limited, uh, this is a variant cover. I do not know the artist. I uh, will try to look that up. Uh, got that one there. Let me, move, let me move these. Then I also picked up uh, Uncanny X Men issue number 170 right there in the newsstand. I also picked up Savage Avengers issue number one, the Scotty Young variant. Really cool looking cover there. I know there's a lot of Scotty Young fans out there. And then I just couldn't pass this up. I saw these. They actually had two copies of Wolverine issue number 17. Iconic cover there. 
Uh, they're both really nice. So I picked those up and they were five bucks a piece. I think it's well worth it. So those are just a few of the ones I got there. Now let me, this is the uh, eBay purchase that I picked up uh, last week. Uh, this particular book uh, is an uh, Uncanny X-Men uh, book and it will um, complete a very large portion of my uh, run that I got. Alright, this book is Uncanny X-Men issue 155. It's also in a newsstand. Uh, so I picked this one up off of eBay, and with this book, uh, it does, I now have issue, I have a good bit of, I have over 300 Uncanny X-Men uh, books in my collection, but I do have a run right now going from issue number 130 through 368, I believe, and this was the only one that was missing and i now have this one in there so i'm very happy about that so that's uncanny x-men issue number 155 in the newsstand very happy about that very nice condition there so got that in there so very happy uh, so uh, please take a moment to uh, let me know what you think about these books that i uh, showed you uh, please like comment and subscribe uh, let me know what you think also, uh, please take a moment and go check out my Instagram account. Also, I here soon I'm going to start selling uh, comics on eBay uh, and also um, on uh, whatnot. Um, I will let you know what the eBay store's name is in the future, uh, but the whatnot is uh, I have comic issues also. Uh, so, thank you for watching the video and. Uh, I'll see you next time. And this is Bryant with I Have Comic Issues, and I hope you do too.